Kailangan mo ng cellphone, kailangan mo ng load na pang internet, at kailangan mo ng credit card or debit card. Kung meron ka ng tatlong bagay na nabanggit ko, pwede-pwede ka na kumita kahit nakaupo ka lang at nagsa-cellphone sa bahay mo. Paano? Gamit ang Facebook. Alam niyo ba na ang Facebook ang number one na social media site? More than just a video para ma-connect tayo sa mga friends natin online, ang Facebook ay magamit mo para maka-advertise at makapag-promote ng products mo online to a larger audience. Here are some of the reasons why Facebook is the most effective marketing tool. Number one, popular, fast-growing, and wide potential customer reach. Ang Facebook ay dominant over other social media platforms. With about 1 million users sa buong mundo on a daily basis, pwede mo itong gawing advantage mo to increase awareness on your brand. Number 2, Free or Low Startup Cost Facebook advertising is budget-friendly. Pwede kang mag-post sa Facebook for free or pwede ka rin mag-boost within your budget para mas marami ang mga kita ng posts mo online. Alam mo ba na for as low as 51 pesos, pwede ka nang mag-boost? Number 3, Facebook advertising is highly targeted. So sa Facebook, pwede mong i-target ang potential clients mo in terms of age, gender, location, interests, and other factors. And with that said, dito sa video na ito, tuturuan ko kayo kung paano kayo gumawa ng sarili niyong page, mag-post ng material online, at mag-boost. Para makagawa ng sarili mong Facebook page, just click create na makikita mo sa newsfeed ng Facebook account mo. Just go to page and click get started under business or brand. Type the name of your page so hindi advisable na gamitin ang Camellia Sorsogon or Lysandra Sorsogon as page name. You should have your own unique page name which is simple, short, and specific. For category, just type real estate at may drop down na lalabas para mapili mo kung ano yung specific category ng page mo. For address, just type the location of the subdivision. So, Lysandra Sorsogon is located at Barangay Kabidan, Sorsogon City, Sorsogon with zip code 4700. And after that, you may also enter your phone number and once done, click continue. Facebook will then ask you to add a profile picture. So you may upload a profile picture of your choice. And another one is the cover photo. So just upload your own cover photo. You may create your own material or you may download the Facebook cover uploaded at our official pages and just edit the contact number. And that's it. You have successfully created your own Facebook page. For clients to easily find your Facebook page, you have to create your own username. To create one, just click the username which can be found below your Facebook page name. Type the username that you want to use and take note this should also be related to your page name. Facebook will then notify you if the username is not available for you to be able to change it and after that just click create username so username is again used for people to easily find your page kahit hindi nila i-type sa search bar yung name ng page mo the next step after page creation is posting so para makapag-post ka sa facebook page mo just go to create post write a simple short and specific caption and upload your material so, dito pwedeng photo, pwedeng video, or pwede ring link ang i-upload mo. You may also click get messages so that your post includes a button for people to reply in messenger. Laging tatandaan na ang caption ng post ay hindi dapat sobrang haba. It must only include the highlight or yung gusto mong iparating sa mga makakakita ng posts mo and of course the call to action. 
Example ng call to action is contact us, PM is the key, or reserve now. After that, just click post and there you have it. So, ang ideal post timelines natin is 6 a.m., 12 noon, 5 p.m., and 9 p.m. The next step after posting is boosting. Just scroll down sa baba ng post mo at makikita mo ang boost post button and click it. Pwede kang mamili sa objective kung gusto mong maraming tao ang mag-react, comment, and share sa post mo or kung gusto mong mag-connect and chat with potential customers. Pwede mo ring matarget ang audience na gusto mong makakita ng post mo in terms of gender, age, location, and interests. For location, pwede mong ilagay yung province or country kung saan located yung product na pinost mo. And you can also choose other countries outside of the Philippines kung saan mo gustong umabot yung post mo. For detailed targeting, pwede mong i-type yung demographics, interests, or behaviors ng audience na gusto mong makakita ng post mo. Now that your audience is defined, just click Save. After that, just scroll down para ma-edit mo yung duration and budget ng boosted post mo. So dito, pwede mong ma-edit kung ilang days mo lang gustong i-run yung boosted post mo as well as the budget na i-allocate mo. Accepted payment options for Facebook ads includes credit cards and debit cards, PayPal, direct debit through bank account, or local manual payment methods. Once you have enrolled your chosen payment method, just click Boost and wait for Facebook's notification if your ad has been approved. So that's it! Kung nagawa mo na yung 3 easy steps, nakakreate ka na ng sarili mong Facebook page, nakapag-post ka na ng material mo online, at nakapag-post ka na, get ready para sa maraming inquiries na mamuha mo at later on closings na darating sa'yo. And that ends our video for today. Please give this a like, comment down below, and share our video to your co-sellers. And watch out for our next digital